The sneaker reselling season is back and in this video, I'm about to tell you exactly how you can cop the Jordan 4 craft. Now, like I said, it's been kind of dry for this first month of the sneaker reselling season, but now we got our first shoe of the year that I'm gonna make a whole how to cop guide on and I think is worth everybody who's trying to make some money. Whether you're a reseller or not, you should definitely try for these shoes. Now, before we get into that, what up? My name is Rico. I make a video every day about how to make money online. Hey, comment where you from. I'm trying to make a map that pretty much tells me every place I've touched within the last year. And if I give you some value by the end of this video, man, please give your boy a subscribe. But before we jump on this computer and I tell you all the places that you can get this shoe, but I'm gonna tell you off the rip, this shoe is worth going for because in the current sneaker climate right now, the Jordan 4 is actually what the Jordan 1 was back in 2020, meaning the Jordan 4 is pretty much the most hyped sneaker, the most hyped silhouette. That's the one that all the hype beasts are wearing. And so when you take a shoe like this, a clean shoe, a clean colorway, then a lot of people are gonna want it. But let's jump on the computer and let me show y'all what we going. Where are we? We are inside Rico's Cooks. This is my cook group where we kind of provide drop information. As you see right here, this is a list of all the raffles, just any possible raffle you can enter for a sneaker, we have it. We just kind of share that information in here. And as you can see here, there's quite a bit of raffles already available for this shoe. So like this one, you would enter at Sneaker Room, just to give y'all an idea of how it will work. And then boom, I would be able to enter just like this, right? And so just by doing that, you're gonna be able to hit on a lot of sneakers because it's a numbers game at this point. Here, the, here's the Air Jordan 4 Craft, and it is retailing at about 210 right so once again this is a nice shoe nice silhouette they've been kind of upping the quality on fours here lately bro like i know the i'm i'm in is probably like a a premium shoe but one thing i noticed when i held them was just like it seems like they're starting to be better crafted and i'm even noticing like if you notice on this picture right here um like the insoles are starting to be padded and it's starting to just become a really really a uh, nice shoe, right? So they're coming out in grade school and men's, right? And so what we're gonna do is we're gonna come up, come over here to Stock X, right? And what you see on Stock X, first of all, is that this shoe, it's it's up in I would say around the, you know, 350, 380-ish type range. We know what happens as far as when a shoe comes out, and even if we look at the map, we know okay they first started circulating maybe at the beginning of january and they've kind of stayed steady but you know what release date is on its way you know what i mean so you see that drop and then you see it start to come up now what you're seeing on this map isn't you know this is like the lowest ask right this is this isn't the overall value of this shoe but i would say um bigger sizes to maybe nine through i guess 18 or whatever is what i mean right so in those sizes we're looking at about 350 on um, resale and then when they drop i think they'll even come down a little bit because it's such a clean shoe and it's a jordan 4 i think people are still gonna try to get this shoe right now let's look at grade school right because one thing that i used to ignore was grade school but now i'm learning that i shouldn't ignore it so jordan and when you look at resale on this then you kind of see that right now it's kind of around the 250 ish range something like that i'm interested to see the data so it's kind of been steady this shoe has been steady but once release date comes we know it's gonna change right so um definitely go out to grade school as well because guess what at 150 bro whenever you can you know even look at it on the surface and see that you can profit maybe a hundred dollars or even even more than that then it's worth it because even with fees or even if you come down a little bit then it's still some good profit on this shoe right so now we're gonna talk about how to get them right so we're gonna talk about the best way for you to cop this sneaker the very best way for you to get this shoe right now is probably going to be on the sneakers app right the most uh, the most stock is going to be on sneakers now if you see here like on shoe palace right i know a lot of people try to hit on these smaller places and that's not a bad idea however like you see here which we do provide this in my cook group as well um you see the total stock on shoe palace is only 300 357 right so when you take into account how many people are going to be going for that then pretty much you know bro the botters are going to feast on this right now if you've been covering if you've been watching me over the last two months then you've seen that i've pretty much been preaching using multiple nike accounts right and so on a shoe like this 
you definitely need to use several accounts to boost your chances so but ultimately what you want to do i say if you got about five or more accounts then you're likely to hit on this shoe the demand is definitely there but it's not just super crazy like that so i think that most people have a chance just to briefly just to briefly brief y'all on that process it's pretty much simple you have several nike accounts you put them on different browsers you have them on different proxies and so what you're able to do is pretty much enter those nike accounts all at once increasing your chance to win after that you got they are loaded on Foot Locker Flex. Now, as far as Foot Locker, I'm only seeing these loaded at the Broadway location, which also lets you know that this is an exclusive shoe. Now, if you want to enter, you can spoof your location over there. There's information um, about how to spoof your location, and there's several different ways to do that. So that pretty much leaves, once again, sneakers, like I said at the beginning, as your best chance to cop this shoe. Now, um, one thing I don't want to forget about when talking about using multiple cameras of accounts because that's going to be our most realistic way is outside of using as many accounts as possible right um you're going to need proxies with your different ip addresses because if you're like if you've ever noticed i had somebody tell me before like bro whenever me and my brother go for the same shoe like one of us hits and one of us doesn't why is that that's because y'all on the same ip right so after one of y'all hits the other one gets hit as a botter the other one gets flagged pretty much so if you don't have proxies or multiple ip addresses then what you're gonna need to do is if you have a phone one of y'all run on the wi-fi run of you um run off of your mobile data because your mobile data has a different ip address is a different network right also the same address right that's how they flag people as far as botten so what you need to do is jig your address jig your address is simply the process of altering it so it doesn't get filtered um for instance if your address is 123 main street then on one of your accounts have it like that but on the other one have 123 main and then spell out street or abbreviate it whichever one you did in or did do at the beginning right you can add um if it's a house you can add all the rooms in your house right um at, at a certain point my my house don't have 10 rooms but I've, I've got it numbered one through 10 right so that's definitely definitely something else you need to watch out for and then payment methods right if you're paying on the same card if you're using the same card as somebody else one of y'all is going to get flagged and one of y'all is not going to get selected right so like i said man the sneaker reselling season is back and it's just the beginning man and it's about to heat up. So let me know what y'all think about these shoes in the comments. It's your boy Rico. I'm out.